Right, this is super hot. Um, I've been playing it for a bit, so this isn't the uh, initial uh, screen. You have to go through a sort of a hacker type uh, story, which reveals the super hot XE. And you, but you can see that the uh, the menu is is like the old DOS uh, Norton Commander. Now all these directories have stuff in. I've not had too much prepared with any of them yet. We'll play the game instead. Uh, there's a readme. Uh, replays didn't work. Anyway, we'll play the game. Now this was funded on Kickstarter after a, I think it was a game jam demo or something. So the gimmick is nothing, nothing moves unless you move. So everything's stationary, oops, mouse sensitivity sucks. Now you see that he's moved. And now I, evidently what I want to do is run away from... Ugh, run away from this truck. No. It would help. see. Now I have noticed with this, there is a bug. Whenever I first load it, in the, I just can't turn all the way right. I don't know what the uh, reason for it is. Right, someone shoot at me. I hope this dude is. Now, so, now we know what's going on. Ah, why? See, I can't turn right. It just sticks. Now I can't turn left. So let's move slowly that way. I still can't turn right. It's actually worse than what it was. First of all, it was when I first played it. Mostly because there wasn't anything this time sensitive. That is a bit glitchy. I don't know how much that is. It's down to me now recording. I should point out that I've had to completely reinstall my computer. What am I supposed to go for? Perhaps some bottles. I had to put it reinstall my computer this week. Because uh, my hard drive failed. So I'm now on Fedora 23. And it's possible. Throw the ball. Punch the man, punch the man, punch the man, pick up his gun. Now we've got to find some other people to shoot. It's quite a strange mechanic. It was it was quite uh, fated at the time. Of, uh, I see now I can turn this way, which is nice. Missed him. No, am I? 
how many of them did I take out? I got them all anyway. Well, there you go. So, basically, although it's in the form of a first-person first shooter, it's a puzzle game. Uh, the puzzles are... Now what's going on? Oh, no. Next level. Alright, so now we'll get some of the... Uh, Or hacker action. Right, enter to apply. Look who's back. Uh, well, it's not super true because I've only been playing it for 40 minutes. Now you can type anything you want here. It always puts the text in, but you have to type something. It's a bit of a weird. Uh, Maybe some plot. Uh, seriously, I can spell seriously. I would never type that. Things that suck. Making my character say things like seriously. So we download a new file. Password protected. We shall see. We don't have to work anything out here. So obviously here we have the old school turbo loader. There you go, I typed password and it let me in. What a surprise. It's like the code of my luggage being 1234. Okay, so we'll have a new level. Once again with the old mouse action. Once again I can't turn any further than that. It's just it's just weird. So basically on this level I'm screwed because I can't turn to look at anything that's coming. see anything. Oh well, there we go. So you cracked the system. I still can't turn there. Can't turn right right up. So let's see when I restart if I can do it. No. This kind of buggers it up as far as I can't go down now. Now what's going on? So once again, so I think it would be quite an interesting game if it didn't have these weird input bugs. It's not the first game to have weird input bugs on Linux. But there you go. It does make it, oh see now I can turn around, so why, it's just it's just frustrating the way it works at the minute. You'd, you'd think, you'd think. With the amount of time they've spent on it. time they spent on it, they'd have sorted this sort of stuff out. So, you can throw guns. I 
as well as uh, shoot with them. You can also melee people. And I can still turn all the way around at the moment. We're looking for another guy. flickery at the minute. Oh, there he is. Super. Super hot. Hot. Super hot. Super hot. So then you can see you Super get this replay. Hot. Super hot. There's a replay exit hot. on the main menu, but that doesn't seem to work. Are you with them? So there is some mystery going on. Oh. We can see you. That's good to know. Let's head back to the main menu for a moment. So there's this replays actually. That opens Killstagram, apparently. Although it doesn't appear to do anything. Uh, settings. Uh, I've apparently got everything on. I'm going to restart that. I uh, say, so that could reset the story mode. Uh, car trip. Auto carpet generator. High end sailing. Listening to hacking. There we go. Yeah, I'm not that worried about it. Demos. Sinus app. <laughs> there you go, a nice DOS uh, sign a sort of wave. Pipes. Hey, uh, DOS screensavers. So there are some, there are some quite cool touches. The concept, I think, is quite nice. I mean, that's why I backed it on Kickstarter. Because I quite like the concept. Uh, I'm not sure the final game totally live up to the weight at the minute and mostly because of this this whole issue with the mouse control not working right it's just it's just annoying and you know it doesn't put me in a positive frame of mind to uh, play the rest of the game uh, hopefully they'll sort all that out they'll sort all that out before long um, it is I understand fairly expensive for uh, you know that's one of the complaints people have said. Well, obviously, wait for a sale if you feel that way. Uh, I think I'm glad to finally see the game from back to a while back, and uh, hopefully they uh, fix it all uh, quite quickly. Uh, so this is super hot. Release a day, uh, day one line of support. Uh, check it out on Steam. <laughs>